We're back out at the LAX Metro Transit Center. And we're coming up to the home stretch. 1.2 million hours of work hours on this facility, which is set to open in November 2024. All right, so here's one of our overhang signs. So you're not gonna be entering here off of aviation. This is gonna be uh, voted to buses only. They have a uh, dedicated bus area, some bus stops to uh, either drop you off or pick you up. So let's take a good look here at this sign. Okay. And we've got one of these, um, I don't know what we're gonna call these, or maybe administration offices or um, maybe ticket stations, I'm not sure. But uh, this one's got the uh, glass window paneling up. They are still doing some work here on the median. There's one of the, a couple of the escalators. I don't know if that includes a stairway, but to get you up here to the second level here. The transit center. We've got some of this landscaping going here from um, this walkway area on aviation. And hopefully, these trees will start getting bigger. And maybe we'll get some good rain over the winter to uh, get their roots going. And it'd be nice to have some shade here, you know, in the foreseeable future for people that are walking or riding their bikes around this area. And they are eventually getting some landscaping going as well. Which hopefully they pick up on this. We're in late October. We're about a month away from this uh, opening to some degree. Um, it should be pretty much finished and on budget. Uh, just, a sh just a shade under $900 million, according to a report that came out recently. And just like in the rendering, there is a sign here, We've got the Metro logo. And then with that, the LAX slash Metro Transit Center, uh, pretty modest, nothing too fancy. And I think that's the only one I've seen so far. I'm sure there's maybe another one on the cross street eventually. I think they're still doing some uh, cosmetic work and some other things uh, over here on the con rack. But I am seeing some vehicles here and there coming around through there. I don't know if it's being utilized or not, but uh, they still have some more things to plant. Across the way from the across the way from the Metro Transit Center in Conrock is the uh, transportation hub, the uh, next to the uh, ITF West, which uh, they're doing some kind of some kind of footings or something here, and uh, doing some compacting and uh, grading, different things like that. All right, so towards the end of the the uh, transit center. You can see the Metro logo, and then you've also got two other symbols. Uh, one being a bus, the other being the rail. And I guess you could have put a, uh, one more, maybe like a bicycle, because you can ride your bike here and lock up here. They're gonna have like a bike hub. So maybe they'll put one more on, but it looks like they're probably just gonna go with like the simplistic three. So it's hard to see really anything with the transportation hub, but there are maybe some slivers here. But it's basically just, they're just doing a lot of um, grading and uh, compacting and wetting down the dirt. Um, but it, this is gonna, this should be a pretty simple project. I mean, it's just a lot of um, uh, like asphalt and concrete, um, temporary parking. Pick up zone, pick up loading zones, things like that. But uh, yeah, it is a little bit frustrating. I can't. I guess I can reach my arm up there to see more, but there really isn't too much going on. I mean, 
Nothing very sexy with uh, dirt being pushed around. But that's what's going on over here uh, concerning this transportation hub on the ITF West. Sorry, the ITF East. I don't know why I'm saying the West. The West is over, the ITF West is over by the, the economy parking. Now here's another um, overhead sign. Now this one, in addition to buses only, is this, is this gonna be for employees as well? I guess there'll be a designated employee parking area. Yeah, they're gonna have to really get going on this and crank it up a notch. Um, if they've got maybe um, another month to go. I mean, again, we're in late October. They're scheduled November 2024. Uh, they say to be complete, but not uh, as far as uh, transactions being made. Uh, as far as um, uh, riders, but it should be, you know, a dry opening around then. See some of these uh, finishes that are completed. Over by this escalator, it looks like there's some more. They have this framing that will be for you know, some guidance for pedestrians where, where they're, uh, which direction they're headed. work here. Um, it's a bus station. Overhangs with uh, I guess there will be signs designating uh, the different um, different routes for the buses. There's an aviation sign. 